So here's a little close-up version of the central nervous system. You see the brain here sitting in the skull or the cranium and the spinal cord going right down through the middle of the vertebra. All right. One thing people don't really understand is the vertebra, the, I mean, the spinal cord sort of ends way up here in the, I guess you would call it upper lower back, if you will. And then it turns into these tail-like structures that come down. Uh, this is why when a woman is giving birth and she is in so much pain that they want to give her an epidural to numb her lower body, they will make the injection in here. They will do the spinal tap in this region so as to reduce any risk of nicking the spinal cord. Uh, still very powerful nerves and nerve tissue here, but still it's a little bit more spread out than it is a solid cord. So that's the brain and spinal cord of the central nervous system.